Welcome back to Love and Junk. I'm Laura. I'm John. And today we have a super exciting new pudding, American pudding, <laughs> to try yeah. with you, for you. Have you seen this line of new treats yet? These are the colliders. Yeah, they're all colliders and there's different ones. There's twisted, chopped, and layered. Yep. And so we want to know, what are all the flavors they come in? Which one do we like best? Is it worth repurchasing? All the things, what do we read it? We're gonna dive right in right now, I'm ready. All right, so a while back you may have remembered that we did a food news. Remember when we did food news? Um, and we announced that they were going to be coming out with these. If you're not familiar with Food News, maybe I can pop one of them in. Yeah. Uh, we were doing them every month, and then because of the thing, the global unpleasantness, uh, stuff started to kind of slow down. We were hard pressed to find new things. Yeah. I'm sure we will be doing another Food News soon, coming up for maybe fall, winter of this year. Maybe sure. we'll do them more quarterly than uh, once a month. But it was a time that we just sat down and told you what new products are on you know on to be, yeah and what's trending and all of that stuff and we announced that these were coming out and that's been a while it's been a few months and we've yeah. never tried them so we're excited to have found them yeah we and, finally found them yeah um so i've got a kit kat collider this is one of the twisted ones it's a vanilla flavored dessert and then in the top there's uh kit kat crumbles mixins yeah, yeah. mixins and there's two desserts in each package. Is it vanilla, did you say? Yep. Okay, so that kind comes in Reese's, Kit Kat, and Cookies and Cream, and what I think would be my favorite, well, Reese's, we all know would be my favorite, <laughs> but also Heath. Oh, nice. We did see Heath, too. Yeah, uh, I love Heath toffee. And then we have, what is this? This one's chopped, so this one, uh, comes in Reese's also, Hershey's Chocolate, S'mores, or Hershey's Mint. And on these, the dessert is a different flavor, and then it has chopped chocolate to mix in. So this is actually a mint-flavored dessert yeah. pudding, whatever. Mint-flavored dessert with dark chocolate pieces. And that sounds amazing. We love mint and dark chocolate around here. Yeah. I love this mint. Stuff. John loves dark chocolate. I'm really looking forward to this last one, though. You are? Okay, and this kind is layered, so we're both really excited to try Rolo. This is the layered version, and um, this also comes in York peppermint patty, Ooh. which I think I would love, but we didn't choose it because of the, we were getting mint over here. It comes in Mounds Bar. Oh, nice. Which I think would be good, and then Reese's. Nice. And yeah, this those all one, sound good. This one says, this is a caramel flavor dessert, and it has the chocolate topping, so. Okay. Yeah. We should probably do mint last. Yeah, mint last. Okay, how about Kit Kat? Yeah, how about it? All right. Yeah, look at that. This little container. Mm -hmm. um, if I can figure out how to pop the top. Well, he does that. Let me say hello and welcome, or welcome back to our channel. We try food. We love international food. We love trying new things. We both love to cook. We have a garden. We love to travel. Pretty soon we're going to be going to Chicago. Uh, we might be doing a little Route 66 trip or you know we have a lot of fun things and then of course fall and the holidays we have a ton of fun stuff coming up so make sure you're subscribed to our channel and hit the little bell Ding. so that you can be notified when our new videos go out we put up a video every single day we just never really know what time we try we aim for between 11 and 1 central standard time which is our time um yeah go ahead but you know Sometimes that doesn't happen. Sometimes we put up more than one video. So if the bell's on, you'll get notified. Yeah. All right, so it's like Kit Kat shavings. Yep. It All right. sure is. Since we're sharing, I should ask you, are you, do you want to mix it or try it like that? Uh, let's try it like that. 
Okay, I want to try the dessert by itself, All pure, right. first and see what I think Me of too. just the pudding part. Cheers. <laughs> Yum. Very vanilla-y. Vanilla yep, vanilla pudding. All right, now I'm going to mix in a little bit. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to hang on to it. Okay. I mean, this is going to be good, right? Of course. As a kid, my mom mm. always tried to sneak things into pudding and jello. Always. <laughs> she would make butterscotch pudding and then put raisins in it mm. and ruin it for me because I was a piggy eater. So I wasn't sure if I, how I would like the texture. I like it. I like it too. But mostly, I like it for the Kit Kat flavor, you know? You know what I like it? Kit Kats are so good. For me, I struggle, and I talk about this all the time, I have a nut allergy, so I struggle with finding texture, and I miss that sometimes. So it kind of gives me a little bit of crunch that I don't always get. Like, you know, ice cream a lot of times for, uh, for texture, there's nuts in it or whatever. Right. I like it. Me too. That's yummy. Um, couple of bucks. Yeah, not bad. Mm-hmm. That's the size of it, and you get two of them. I think they were two something. Yeah. So you only get a couple. It's not very big. Um, That's good, though. Yeah. Pretty sure you can probably make something like this on your own, using your own vanilla pudding. And... Oh, I'm positive. And, yeah, you can buy Kit Kats. Okay, put that down now. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? What is this supposed to be? Oh, it's layered, right? Yeah, Rolo. So does it actually have car excuse me. Caramel flavored dessert. Okay, so chocolate pudding on the top and caramel dessert on the bottom. Like Yeah, so it's supposed to be flavored like so Rolos, Rolo. but there's not actually Rolos. That's in what it. I wanted to know if there was actually Rolos in it. Now over at, like where we live and probably everywhere. If we wanted to make pudding from scratch, we could make it whatever flavor we wanted, but you can't buy packets of pre-made caramel flavored pudding. So I've never had caramel pudding before. Oh, me neither. So I'm gonna try to try that by itself. This is really good. That's yummy. Whoa, it's like a nice mousse. I mean, yeah, it seems thicker, mm -hmm. doesn't it? I'm gonna try mm -hmm. the chocolate by itself. That's good. Mm hmm That is good. I like that. I like, I like that better than them. Don't say that yet. You gotta rank them all again. All right. Whoa. Now we can pick this up. All right. Ready? Mint. 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 Can you pass it along? Good. Yeah. Goodness. Made me think when I saw the Mounds Bar thing. I don't think they've done this. Oh, so is the pudding on the, oh, the pudding on the Mounds Bar one is coconut pudding. Ooh. It's gotta be. That I want to try. Look at that green. But wouldn't it be fun to do like, um, you could make Mounds Bar pudding and have coconut mixed in with it too and little chocolate shavings. Like the coconut could be textured too. Yeah. That would be yummy. That would be yummy. Oh, I want to try the mint by itself. All right. That is strong mint. That is strong, strong mint. Mm. Isn't it? Yeah, it is. Kind of reminds me of like um, mint chip ice cream. Mm-hmm. Very similar to the flavor. Mm-hmm. Have you gotten it with the chocolate? Oh. Oh, there you go. Mmm. <laughs> If that were my own personal one and I was eating it, I would really want to mix it up a lot more. Mm. I just got mint by itself and a whole mouthful of chocolate. You know what I mean? I still think it's good though. That's a good mint. Oh yeah, it's good. You're going to have to play this game with me. Tell me, or not the game really, but are they all the same? 
calories and such. Let's see. We're not looking for nutritional value because, you know. <laughs> the Rolo, 200 calories. Kit Kat, uh, 220. And the Hershey's Mint, 210. All right. So how do we feel about that? 210 calories for that amount. I mean, we knew it wasn't going to be low calorie. Right. I don't know that I would... I shouldn't say I don't know. I would rather have mint chocolate chip ice cream than this. Hey. I would rather have mint chocolate chip ice cream than this. Would you? Yeah. Um, but, you know, that's a good snack to take on the go if you need it. But you well, do got to keep it chilled, right? Right. Well, also the thing is mint chocolate chip ice cream takes up a big thing in the freezer. And that you can just put in the refrigerator. Right. It's not super cost effective with it being too something for two little tubs because here pudding cups you can get i don't know what do they sell them in four packs four sometimes and six I sometimes think. they're a dollar yeah and i would say you get more pudding because that would be like you know a pudding cup is bigger than half of this right and they sell them for a dollar <clears throat> i understand you don't get the extra little topping but you're also not paying for because where's the Rolo in this, really? Right. That's Rolo inspired. Yeah, but it still is like my favorite one of the bunch. Yeah, but I'm just saying cost. I'm talking yeah, about cost. Yeah, 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 cost. I mean, that could just be any, that could be great value brand pudding. Right. You know, with chocolate and caramel pudding and be a little bit. They're paying for Rolo is what I'm saying, and there's right. no Rolo in there. No Rolo in there. Um... I, all that being said, I don't I don't think they're very practical, but they're so dang good. They're good. <laughs> okay, let's rank them. Okay. Favorite to least. Oh, I gotta think about this. Favorite to least favorite. You can go first if you want. Um, they're already in the order. They are. Yeah, I like the Rolo number one, the Mint number two, and then the Kit Kat third. I like the Kit Kat. The Kit Kat's my favorite part of that dessert, but like the vanilla pudding in it. I mean, it's just vanilla pudding. Yeah, it's, you know, and the v vanilla flavor in it is pretty strong, which kind of makes it seem a little artificial to me, which I'm it sure is. it is. <laughs> it, it, you know, it's one of those things. We understand, like when we eat Oreos sometimes and we're like, it's so artificial tasting. And we understand that it is artificial tasting because it is artificial. Right. But you don't want to be reminded of that. Right? No, no. There are things that do have artificial flavors that they do it well, and other things are not done well at all, and it tastes like chemicals. That's right. These are all done very well. Those other flavors that I said, I can understand how Reese's would translate to each of these three oh, yeah. kinds. I can understand what I say in this one. There was also, well, it in some of them, there was cookies and cream. I think uh -huh. that's this one, maybe. Um, Reese's in all three. And then there was mounds in the layered, which I can see that being be good. really good. Yeah. Um, so look at your pocketbook and decide if you should buy them. If money is no object and calories are no object, I would say get them. Sure. If you're watching your calories or counting your nickels, I would say I skip. Skip. Skip and make it at home because pudding is really inexpensive yeah. to make. Right. And for the price of these, you can get pudding and candy bars to put in it. Y yeah. There's there's that whole thing. So, uh, on a scale of throw it in the trash to run, hurry, and get more, was there any other flavors <clears throat> that you think, now that we've tried this, I really want to get my hands on? Mm, I would, like you said, the mounds. I wouldn't mind trying that. I think that would be interesting. Yeah. I think the um, the other one that I would like, I keep pointing to this one, but I mean this. This is what has mounds, the layered. Yeah. There was also a York Ooh, peppermint yeah. patty, which I think would be different than this yeah, mint. Yeah, I think so too. And I think I would like it better with the chocolate pudding instead of the chocolate. The chunks, this yeah. makes me feel inspired now that the holidays are, you know knocking on they're not here but they're knocking on our door you know in youtube world you do things up ahead when you can right now it makes me think about all the things and some of you have said you should make a trifle where you use custard and so maybe we can make some sort of holiday Ooh. you know desserts 
uh, you know, inspired by these maybe, but sure. with our own flavors and whatever. So let us know if you've tried these, what you thought, which one you think uh, you would like the best. If you're not following us on social media, please come find us. Our links are in the channel banner, which is the place where our pictures are. Everything's linked there except for TikTok. Right. But we have a TikTok, so if you're on we TikTok, do. come find us and come support us, us over there too. Uh, now, if you love pudding, either kind oh, yeah. <laughs> or desserts in general, Rolo or um, Mint, this isn't a brand. It's, well, Hershey's. I yeah. don't know. Maybe we shouldn't say that. If you like us. <laughs> or, or the dessert, video. <laughs> yeah. Maybe we shouldn't say that. But I think a lot of people do love Rolo. I think a lot of a lot of people love oh, Kit, Kit Kat. Kat. Let, yeah. Or Mint. Let's just say that. Or us or the video. Please give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps our channel when you do that. That's all we have for today. See you next time. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.